Okay, hey there, this is Hannah from Hannah Helps, Online Marketing Bootcamp, Day 3. And this is where should you send your leads to? Okay, very important. We, you know, previous days we've talked about um, um, requiring website, blogs, and or landing page. Okay. So I'm sure you've heard that, you know, people say you need to have a blog, right? And I mean, people are like, well, what's a blog? You know, I don't know how to write. There's a lot of ways, um, and if you know, we do drill down these things, and we do talk about this. We do have a membership membership site. If it's not ready right now, when you're seeing this, it will be ready very soon. Um, we'll take you through building step by step, and the importance of blogs, um, and where you can find articles if you can't write them yourself. Um, it's all about value, what you're giving to your readers. Okay, so send them to your blog. Uh, give them value and info. All right, if you don't have a blog or if, you know, because it could take time. I mean, there are people who, who, um, who you can outsource this to. And, uh, you know, there's Fiverr.com, Elance, you know, you can just talk. Oh, Blogger, Blogger, um, which is a Google app you can quickly create a blog of course most people talk about WordPress and WordPress is very flexible you can uh, put a lot of plugins in and, and do a lot of opt-ins it's, it's great okay but they all have each advantages you know how fast you can get things done there are free sites out there like Wix, Weebly um, you know WordPress could be free if you don't you don't even need to host it WordPress can host it Blogger is free so there are many out there, I mean, you can have your website or blog um, done in a few hours or in a day. It depends on how much information you want to put in there. Okay, but uh, I, I say, you know, give appropriate info, uh, things people need. Um, make it interesting. Make it enticing. Um, you know, even if you, you know, you pull in other people's um, links and sites. Just make sure it's interesting that people will go back to you and will we'll make it memorable. Okay, um, giving them value. You know, what what do they need? Who's your target market, right? So, in this diagram, very simple. You know, the blog contents right there. That we're talking about driving traffic, right? And making sure the infrastructure is done first, um, and offer sales page. This is a typical online blog funnel. You know, we're talking about email campaigns in the earlier. Um, uh, day one and um, you know email nurture okay, a sales page so I don't really want to go through this whole thing right now but um, send them to your blog next if you don't have a blog or a website you must have a landing page okay that one page will do you've seen them guys you know it's a it's a it's a landing page you know it's usually one page you, there's usually a free giveaway or ebook um, or a video a short video hopefully it's short uh, an opt-in form so you can put your name and email address to opt-in for, for either a newsletter or giving more information or, or um, you know, get the uh, ebook. That's free. You'll see some testimonials on there, okay? This, these two diagrams basically talk about, you know, what a landing page should have, okay? As you can see, catchy, nice-looking headline, all right? There's a little video. Video speaks volumes, um, Really, if you can find videos uh, for what you're doing, do that. If not, make one. Um, a secondary headline, okay. Act now. This is your call to action, okay. Testimonial, always. That's always good. Social proof, uh, and some more information. So this is very short, and you've seen them. Kind of, they all tie into the, you know, when you you don't have to scroll down, kind of thing. Um, but if you do have to scroll down, just make sure all the pertinent information is the top half of your screen okay and you know top uh, bottom half can be more testimonials or more uh, information that uh, you know as they go down but remember that um, readers these days are very impatient um, you know they may stay on your page for three minutes but maybe less uh, it keeps getting shorter so put everything that's important in the very top half of the uh, of the form okay so that's one page, and you can do lead pages. You can get free lead pages uh, through Instapage, 
or uh, lead pages. I don't think it's free, but lead pages and and of course get response, which is a uh, which I use an autoresponder, but also has landing pages. Okay, next. No matter what you where you send them to, remember these main points. You are speaking to your target market. Okay, make act you know make your headlines engaging and active. Bullet points of main ideas you want audience to know uh, to pique their curiosity. A way to send you their info, which is your opt-in form. Um, have videos, short, concise, fun. They're great. Ebook giveaways, any giveaways, etc., are enticing. So get ready to connect, follow up with your leads. Okay, and you, in the next video, you know, we're going to talk about um, setting up a blog um, and possibly a landing page. Okay, have fun, learn lots, and please do what you learn. Thank you.